Okay, so hello everybody. Uh, my name is Yusuf Al-Aghizi. I'm Yahya Fahim. We're Aghizi and Fahim. Today, in this interview, we're going to explain the difference between live mixing, live production, and music composition slash production. Uh, we started DJing uh, four years ago, uh, and um, uh, one of our main influences is a group called the Swedish House Mafia. Uh, okay, so we're first of all gonna start by uh, what is live mix? Live mixing is when you go to a, a venue and you have like a gig to play. You start playing your music and you're mixing the tracks together, so that basically you're entering one track into another track without realizing there are two tracks. Uh, what you're mixing on is a, is a three-part mixer called the, the Pioneer. There are many styles of uh, mixers like Pioneer, Danons. These are the two most popular types of mixers. First of all, you have a mixer in the middle and you have two decks. Uh, you can also add two other decks, so there will be four decks in the mixers. Four channels. Yeah, so you can have four channels. Each mixer has four channels, so you can put four tracks and mix them together at the same time. But basically, what you do is that you put a track into one deck and you put another track into another track and you have to match the tempos together. Other things you have to consider while you're DJing is that uh, uh, you have to have good track selection so that the crowd doesn't sleep while you're playing. You have to, uh, um, you have to like read the crowd. Basically, what, what you a good DJ ma makes the crowd makes the crowd goes crazy. The crowd doesn't stop dancing if you're a good DJ. So you have to read the crowd and see which track you're going to put next or which track the the audience want for you to put next that's basically what what makes uh, what differs or what differentiates that basically what differentiates a good dj from a bad dj okay so if you were to uh to dj along someone it would be uh um, axwell yeah axwell from the swedish house yeah okay, there are a lot of softwares you can use uh while you're djing in front of the mix you can use a software called tractor which helps you synchronize the beats automatically. So you download the software contractor on your laptop and then you buy a, a controller so you can control the, the software and then you plug, like you make a lot of connections and then you plug the tractor with the, with the CDJs or with the Pioneers and then you press the sync, the sync button and uh, it simply synchronizes uh, all of your tracks on uh, the BPM you choose, so you don't have to worry about beat matching. Other than that, you can use uh, the record box software on the on the CDJs or on the Pioneers, which is basically that you download the record box software on your laptop and you upload the tracks you're, you're going to play in the, in the gig, and it also automatically synchronizes your tracks. That's live mixing. Uh, now we're going to explain the what is uh, music composition or music production. Basically, music composition uh, is when you uh, is basically when you create music. You now we're going to explain what is meant by music composition or music production. Music composition is basically uh, made uh, on uh, a laptop, on a software on a laptop. You have like more than seven. Softwares nowadays you have Ableton Live, Pro Tools, Logic Pro, Cubase, Fruity Loops, and uh, GarageBand, Sony Acid Music. All of these uh, softwares are uh, used by uh, by musicians or composers in order to create uh, a, a piece of uh, music. So what you do when you uh, when you live uh, when you music is that basically you you create the element elements of a track so for example you record a guitar a guitar line and then you put it and then you record the melody line and 
he put it on the software and you start by adding percussions loops etc and then you make the sequence of the track and you have the track in order to compose uh, music you have to uh, connect a mini controller or a synthesizer uh, which helps you uh, record the, the keys of the of the melody you created or the melody line you created on the on the software okay so uh, the third thing and the most uh, complicated thing is uh, called live production live production is basically you produce or create music live so it has both a mixture of live uh, DJing and music production at home so if you're making live uh, production you basically want to need a laptop where you put the software uh, some um, we, we use Ableton uh, Ableton we can through it we can uh, launch loops using the uh, the uh, launch pad yeah, the launch pad where you can launch loops and you make the, the the track live so it's rather than making a recorded uh, sequence you're playing the sequence live and this the sequence is basically the track and uh, you also can add some uh, FX uh, which is the effects by uh, using uh, other instruments like the uh, key oscillator uh, it's like a it's, it's a, um, an analog a synthesizer which can be used to put some add-ons on the track and uh, there are also MIDI, key MIDI keyboards where you're playing the MIDI notes live and then they're translated to audio sounds uh, then to, to the specific sound you want to generate and this audio is basically the melody and if it's like a saw, a sign, or it's like you created your own preset on a, on a sound, a sound that you like, you created through the, uh, the VST, which is the instrument, the software instrument. Uh, then you play the, the, the melodies and you create your own instruments basically using electronic sounds. Yeah, uh, that's basically it 